So alongside imposter syndrome, one of the the big general challenges for I think all students, but I think especially PhD students, is burnout. So mm. has burnout <laughs> effect, I guess it has. Has how badly has it affected you? And do you think having imposter syndrome has made burnout worse? Or do you think that the burnout would just be there no matter what? Mm. I think there's a moderating effect. I think burnout is going to happen no matter what. I think imposter syndrome can speed up the cycle of burnout. So the way that the system is set up for a PhD is kind of conducive to overworking, overproving yourself. You always have to jump through a hoop. And I will say that that has been very frustrating, um, probably for many students, that you achieve this huge milestone and there's no celebration. It's next day. I remember defending my thesis via Zoom and then it was like, wow, great. And then I had to log into my next class. Like nothing happened. And it kind of took away from this project that I had spent probably a year and a half on just just to have two minutes to be like, okay, a year and a half of work, two minutes to celebrate on to the next thing and then the next meeting. So let's talk about your comps. It's like, wait a second. Can I just have a moment to celebrate my accomplishment? And I think because of that, burnout happens because it then trains students of thinking in what's next, what's next, what's next. There's never... I'm here now and that's perfect. And so I think burnout's going to exist no matter what. Now, when you add imposter syndrome into that mix, there's this moderating effect where it exacerbates it because there's this mental load of, I have to do better. I have to prove. And even maybe some kind of connections between your milestones your progress and your self-worth. And that's a dangerous place to be because like I said, there's always what's next. And if you have this really strong connection between your productivity and your self-worth, not only are you gonna burn out, but you're gonna feel very negatively about yourself.